we're raising the walls on our project house while lowering the chance for bugs, termites, and mold. Hello, I'm Michael Holligan. Let's get started on your new house. Trusses that support the first and second floor were manufactured by American Trust Systems using lumber from international paper. These are called parallel cord open web trusses. Al Sefuentes has been in the truss industry for more than 15 years. You have uh, three basic components. You have the top and the bottom cord of the truss. The, uh, the interior is the webbing. And then the webbing is, is probably the most important component since that's where you have the triangulation of the truss which gives it its, uh, its strength. The open web design also makes it easy to install plumbing, electrical, and other mechanical elements. All the trusses in this house are part of an engineered system. Each truss is custom built to carry a specific load. The bracing that ties the trusses together increases stability and makes the system perform as one structural unit. Building with prefabricated trusses eliminates much of the guesswork and uncertainty about how much stress the frame of your home can handle. In the floor system, we number every truss, every component. We uh, make a placement plan to correspond with that particular number truss. And then we make an effort to educate the framer at the, the installation process, let him know what, what uh, conditions might exist that might make his job a little, little challenging. Once the first floor is fully framed, the crew begins to set the trusses for the second floor. The crew hauls the trusses up to the second floor the old-fashioned way. Once they're set in place, the trusses are nailed to the top plate of the exterior wall. These trusses are almost 30 feet long. This is going to allow our great room to have a wide open area, uninterrupted by pillars, walls, or other structural supports. When you uh, use trusses and you're using a clear span component, clear span meaning that all, the, all its uh, forces and, and load carrying capacity is, is carried to the exterior walls, you're not depending on any interior partitions or, or bearing supports. So you can come in basically and design any type of uh, wall or if you don't want any walls, you want a clear space. Uh, especially nowadays we see in remodeling a lot of open, more open living rooms and so the application of the truss really makes it, makes it real feasible to do that. The trusses are set 18 inches on center. The trusses have a wide top cord, three and a half inches across. This provides greater support for the subfloor and helps eliminate squeaks. Not all trusses look alike. These trusses are called fillers. They don't serve a primary structural purpose, but fill out the end walls and save the framers the time it would take to build this part of the frame on site. When the second floor is fully framed up, it's time to install the engineered roof truss system. These trusses were manufactured by Panel Truss of Texas using lumber from Delta Timber Corporation. They were fabricated for this house and were designed to fill this home's specific structural requirements. Everything is done to the particular plan, to the particular project. Because the trusses come pre-assembled, the framing crew is able to install the roof support in a fraction of the time it would take to frame the roof on site. The roof trusses are spaced 24 inches on center. Once the installation gets underway, the process moves really quickly. These spacers tie the roof trusses together. They give the system greater structural strength by making the entire roof perform as one structural unit. One of the great things about engineered trusses is they distribute the weight away from the center of the room towards the exterior walls. With a proper design, you can really open up the space downstairs so you have bigger, more open rooms. But you can do the same thing upstairs. If the engineer had designed it that way, we could actually add a room up here in the attic. It's a great investment to get as much space as possible. The structural support provided by trusses also gives architects the freedom to design homes with very wide openings between rooms. This helps them create homes with spacious and open interiors. For more information on how an engineered truss system made of southern yellow pine can make your new house safer, stronger, and save you money in the construction process, visit the Southern Pine Council's website at southernpine.com.